Hi, my name is Guy Wallace, and in this PAC video short, we're going to provide an overview of PACT facilitation. PACT is an acronym. It stands for Performance-Based, Accelerated, Customer and Stakeholder Driven, Training and Development of Any Blend. PACT as a definition also stands for a formal agreement, a bargain. In the PACT processes, we produce performance-based training and development content, instruction, and information. We produce this in total cooperation between the supply side and the customer side in an efficient and quick process. We do this by facilitating teams. The PACT practitioner roles include the following. The PACT project manager, who facilitates the project steering team in gate review meetings. The PAC performance analyst who facilitates the analysis teams in the production of the analysis outputs. The PAC CAD designer facilitates the design team in processing the analysis data to produce training and development paths and then event and module specifications for all gaps. The PACT MCD and IED designers facilitates the design team in processing the analysis data to create the event specifications and maps, the lesson specification and maps, and later on the instructional activity specifications. The PACT lead developer facilitates the development team especially in the kickoff efforts where the development team is aligned to the modular design. Key skills of the PAC facilitators include facilitating groups of people. They must also be good at conceptual and concrete thinking. They must be articulate and have very strong verbal communication skills. If a team meeting is used, we recommend using flip charts in order to produce content and post it on the wall for continuous referencing by the analysis and or design teams. This is critical. However, if you're doing this online, it's a very different process. There's active listening skills involved, systems thinking, problem solving, decision making, and inevitably handling some conflict. There are 12 key rules and guidelines for PAC facilitators. They are, go slow to go fast. Be declarative. Write stuff and post it. Be redundant by design. Use the four key communication behavior types. Review and preview. Write it down and then discuss it. Use humor. Control the process and the participants. Be legible on the flip chart. Beware of groupthink and assign parking lot valets. The rest of the videos in this series will cover all of these. Beware of GIGO, garbage in, garbage out. Good stuff in and good stuff out is what we strive for in the PAC processes. That's why we facilitate groups of master performers, other subject matter experts, novice performers, and sometimes supervisors and managers in the production of the analysis data and the production of the designs. I've been practicing, publishing, and presenting on these methods since 1982. My recent book, Six Pack, covers all of this in great detail.